Bhavya learns yoga. Can you believe that animals can teach us yoga? Well, this story is about how Bhavya learnt yoga. Once upon a time, there lived a boy named Bhavya. His mother's name was Nandini and she was a yoga teacher. Every morning Nandini would try teaching Bhavya some yoga poses because yoga is good for health but Bhavya just didn't like doing yoga. His mother thought of trying something new. She took Bhavya to learn yoga from the animals at the jungle safari. They carried their yoga mats and set out for the jungle safari wearing yoga pants. At the jungle safari Nandini rolled out to yoga mats and asked Bhavya to pose like every animal they saw. First Bhavya saw one balancing monkey who had stretched his legs and was grabbing his feet. Bhavya too stretched his legs and grabbed his feet. Lifting up a bit from his seat. Nandini was delighted to see Bhavya strike a perfect yoga pose and she gifted him a yo-yo and a balancing monkey a banana. Next they saw a cobra gliding around in the grass. The cobra lifted its head up to show its fangs. Bhavya struck another pose with his legs firmly touching the mat and head held high up. Nandini helped him adjust his hands straight under his shoulders. She also gave him some yellow bananas to eat along with yogurt for striking a perfect yoga pose. It was an exciting day as Bhavya learnt yoga with the monkey and the snake. Next Bhavya saw a gorilla bending back and gripping onto his heels. Nandini helped Bhavya bend backwards and Bhavya liked looking at everything upside down. Next Bhavya saw some frogs by a pond. Bhavya sat in the same way with his hands in the front and feet flexed, stretched, wide. Bhavya looked just like a frog. When Nandini saw that she jumped up high with joy and promised Bhavya his favorite and the yummiest snack yellow pineapple pie and yogurt salad. Finally, Bhavya spotted a beer. He stood with his legs together and hands stretched out. That's a perfect why, shouted his mother in excitement and scared the beer away. Why why yes replied Bhavya nodding his head and laughing out loud. Finally Bhavya had learnt his yoga. Nandini taught Bhavya to breathe. She asked him to inhale and exhale deeply to feel calm. Bhavya stood on one leg and took a deep breath with a wide smile on his face. Nandini always thought she was a great yoga teacher, but she couldn't be more thankful to the animals at the safari for being the best yoga teachers she had ever come across.